Pela primeira vez jogando Persona 5 <risos> Ah, fuck, a gente foi encontrado de novo Mas bem, se eu ao menos soubesse, cara Na primeira vez que eu joguei, como me movimentar ah, Tá legal, tá, eu vou sair daqui Como me movimentar, eu não teria passado a vergonha que eu passei no primeiro episódio, cara O jeito como eu andava era muito desengonçado Stop right there. Take him down, Joker! <risos> Lá de novo, grandão. E diga adeus. Oh, wait, what? You have progressed well through your recollections. Last spring, you awakened to this furious power. Now, use that power and defeat the enemies before you. Comparing power levels. No threat. Get him, Joker. Persona. Tudo bem, Moloch? Eu poderia muito bem trazer o Arsene pra acabar com você, que nem no primeiro episódio, mas... Naquela época ele tinha um pouco mais de dano, então... É... Vamos deixar pra lá, eu vou pegar o Biaco mesmo, ele tem uma bufula e é a sua fraqueza, eu sei muito bem disso, então... Vá para o chão, cara! Eu vou usar mais uma vez, não tem porque eu hesitar agora! Por favor, consigam... Era exatamente o que eu precisava, agora com o Sexto Strike do próprio Biaco, eu talvez consiga finalizá-lo! Eu consigo, eu consigo! Voa, Biaco! Your fate will soon be determined. Recall everything. Remember the bonds you have forged with your friends. If you are fated to continue past this point, then we shall surely meet again. Okay, pull out before their backup gets here. Tá legal, não precisa falar duas vezes, Futaba. O cara tá ficando cada vez mais interessante. Só espero que eu não tenha que... Ai, meu Deus do céu. Ok, agora você deve conseguir ir. Depressa, Joker. Cara, seu menos está nos ouvindo. Não se preocupa, eu tô pegando a voz de todo mundo aqui, então... Vá logo, Joker. É ah, sério que você tá ouvindo a voz de todo mundo? Eu ainda não ouvi a de uma pessoa, então... Ah, eu sei lá, cara, isso tá ficando tão legal. Tá exatamente igual como no começo. Ah, pois... Eu tenho que dizer, você conseguiu... Você fez um bom trabalho economizando tempo nessa parte, hein? Eu acho que vocês... Acho que o... Katsuro Hashino, ele finalmente conseguiu uma promoção por economizar tempo e dinheiro de vocês. Ah, bem à frente, cuidado! Isso é mal. Se esconda, Joker. Você nunca vai conseguir escapar se continuar lutando. Se esconda nas sombras até ver uma abertura para fugir. Ok, Futal, pode deixar. Eu... Cara, eu lembro como eu fiquei tão ansioso nessa parte por ter... Usar o modo stealth, né? Ter... Dar cover nas coisas. Agora é sua chance. Corra para as escadas. Ok, vamos lá, rápido. He's not alone. Find them and kill them all.
The exit should be up ahead. You're there. That's just how it is. After that commotion, the bottom floor is completely closed off. Hey, can you make it? Over there! There's no way to run! See ya! to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. The drug was too strong. Wake him up. No dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Did you hear my question? Answer! <coughs> Obstruction of justice, blackmail, defamation... Possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? You should know your place. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima, from the Public Prosecutor's Office. The Prosecutor's Office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, 
I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... You prosecutor Sinejima? There's a call from your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. Hmm. I thought I ordered you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. <sighs> Good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Uh, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown. After all, we don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. <laughs> well done on making it this far, inmate. Now that you have traversed your long, perilous recollection, you truly have entered the present. The effects of that drug are gonna wear off soon. This is your golden opportunity. You must grasp the truth that will save you from the brink of ruin. The evil influence who wishes you dead is fast approaching. If you want to win this unreasonable game. If you wish to take back your stolen future. Recall the bonds you formed with your allies and grasp the truth that will save you from the brink of ruin. <laughs> I see. So that's what led to your ending up here. What a disappointing end to the Hero of Justice. I still can't believe it. But I now have a general idea of the methods you used for your crimes. There's much more I'd like to ask, but my allotted time is nearly up. I do have a suggestion, though. Care to strike a deal? If you cooperate with me, I'll consider lightening your sentence. I have a responsibility to solve this case. I will win, even if it means brokering a deal with you. Your operation was leaked and you failed to change my heart. There's no point in being obstinate now. You've corrupted the order of this country and caused an uprising against its very existence. You'll most likely be given life imprisonment or the death penalty, unless you accept my proposal. Going forward, I will read a list of people who are closest to you and this case. Tell me honestly whether or not the following are involved with the Phantom Thieves. First, the friend who you've been with since the day you transferred to Shujin, Ryuji Sakamoto. One of the victims of the Kamoshida case, An Takamaki. Ichiryusai Matarame's pupil, Yusuke Kitagawa. The daughter of Wakaba Ishiki. Futaba Sakura. The heiress to the Okumura Foods legacy and daughter of its CEO, Haru Okumura. And the frequently probing student council president of Shujin Academy, Makoto Nijima. Those are your accomplices in the Phantom Thieves case, are they not? so you won't sell out your friends. Then let me change the question. I find it hard to believe that high schoolers could have pulled off these crimes by themselves. Were there not others outside of your direct group who encouraged your crimes or lent their aid? Not to repeat myself, but remember that your life will be forfeit if your sentence is not lightened. You had the cooperation of people outside your group, did you not? 
Can you tell me about them? I see. So you won't speak a word about either your teammates or your collaborators. Do you even understand the position that you're in? Let's discuss one other person, Goro Akechi. There are reports that he was acting alongside the Phantom Thieves as well. Might he be a part of your team too? So Goro Akechi wasn't one of you. Very well. So be it. You clearly have no intention of bargaining with me. Even now, you're still acting as though you're a hero of justice. Your teammates have sacrificed you in order to escape, yet you wish to defend their honor? Why won't you talk about them? Don't be ridiculous! You're not the one to decide such things! Justice? Then tell me, what is this justice you speak of? Sticking to the right path? That's no different from us. You continue to stand firm. Are you implying that we have no evidence on you? You're right, we have nothing. And it doesn't help that your story sounds like a fairy tale. But many people have fallen victim to this. We need to learn the truth. <sighs> the truth, huh? I don't even know what's right anymore. And it's all due to your strange story. After all this, you're still... Are you listening? The side effects of the truth serum should be wearing off. I won't be deceived by such a poor act. Realized it too then. It was our conversation about pancakes, right? There's no way he could have reacted like that if he hadn't heard me. Hey. Can you hear me? It seems your mind is clearing up. But unfortunately, my time has run out. Although I find your story to be quite interesting, I won't be able to speak with you any longer. Huh? What are you getting at? That's right. No matter the results of this case, I won't be receiving credit. I even had to call in a large favor just to conduct this interrogation. So, how did that thing we asked you to look into go? Mijima mentioned a special interrogation room, didn't she? Good. It looks like we can make this work if we lure them there. Hey. Hey, are you listening? Our time's up. We're done talking here. Goodbye. Do you mean this interrogation room? Why wouldn't I know about it? What an odd thing to ask. Anyhow, there's one last thing I want to ask you. There's something that's been bothering me for some time now. Recently, I was removed from my post as head of this investigation and was told to remain on standby. A short while later, I received word you were caught in the act, within some bizarre phenomenon. But that was all I was told. 
You were told someone sold you out, correct? If that's true, who could it have been? Don't you have any idea? The suspicions were true in the end. Still, to think his true intention was to sell us out. All that's left is to figure out a way to hand it over. It's all up to you, leader. Okay then. Giving him the phone without arousing suspicion will be easier said than done. We'll be counting on you to pull this one off. What's wrong? Might you have an idea as to who sold you out? What do you recall? If you know something, you must tell me. I won't allow things to end like this. You mean this? I've been told the lock on it is quite complicated, but it's only a matter of time until it's cracked. What's so important about this smartphone? Are you going to unlock it and show me the data? Let's let her sleep. She hasn't slept for days while she's been getting that app ready. Now we gotta figure out a way to show him the phone. Makoto and the others should have told you. I'm talking about the true culprit here. You know, the traitor. Hey! What are you trying to get at here? And what about this smartphone? The true culprit? We could say he stole the guard's gun and committed suicide during his imprisonment. How about that? Public security questioning will occur on the first day. And with that room, my task will be simple. And thus, the dangerous criminal responsible for the mass mental shutdowns shall end his own life. Please. I need you to be clear with me. Who am I supposed to show this to? What do you... <gasps> My god. You're referring to him, aren't you? Are you plotting? I can't even begin to fathom it. But it appears my time is up. This is as far as our conversation can go. This will be my last involvement with this case. <laughs> Very well. I've listened to your whole story, so I may as well play along to the end. And that honest look in your eyes. I used to view the world the same way too once. I'll place my bet on you. I just need to show him the phone, right? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of judgment, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. I'll be going now. What good will this do, though? A 
Kechikun? Why are you here? Why do you seem so surprised? I needed my director to step in to get access, and I was directly responsible for this case. How did you get approval? For the same reason you did. I am heading up the investigation team after all. It's only natural I'd have the right to interrogate our culprit as well, don't you think? <gasps> they assigned you command? <laughs> that was a joke, of course. I'm merely here to assist with the public security interrogation. I am surprised it's this far underground, though. There aren't any others incarcerated here, yes? Nobody would ever know if things got a little violent. If I remember correctly, didn't you say there was another culprit besides the Phantom Thieves? That was but a lie I spread to set them up. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot that I had deceived you too, Sai-san. After all, if you wish to trick your enemies, you must first trick your allies. So it was you. You're the one who sold out the Phantom Thieves. I need you to be clear with me. Who am I supposed to show this to? <gasps> My god. You're referring to him, aren't you? Is there a problem? Akechi-kun, does this phone look familiar to you? Hmm? Excuse me? What is this phone? It belonged to the leader of the Phantom Thieves. I believe you'll need it for your investigation. Not personally. I was acting alongside the Phantom Thieves myself, remember? True. This is undoubtedly a great accomplishment. Good luck in there. Hm. Foolish woman. that you accompany me? Going in unarmed to interrogate a murderer makes me uncomfortable. Huh? What are you... I owe you for all of this. Thanks. That's right. You and your little friends were vital to our plan. And now it will be completed. Your popularity truly was quite stunning. That just made using you all the more worthwhile. Have you finally pieced it all together? <laughs> Case closed. This is how your justice ends.